Hi everyone, this is Chris here from My Own House Fix, and today I want to give you a quick overview of a whole house water filtration system. The system we've had installed here for about three years now is the Aquasana whole house water filtration system. It's also made by the Han brand through Costco. It ties in really easily up into the main water line. And you just run the other lines here, and it pops back into the plumbing over in here. So it starts out with a 5 micron pre-filter here, 20 inch. This takes a lot of your rust and sediment out of the water as you'll see a little bit later. The second tank here is a salt free water softener so you don't get all the nasty byproducts from using a, a salt water softener and you don't need the drains and the plumbing and all that associated. This is a standalone system so you don't need any additional plumbing or drains. The second set of tanks here is a crushed mineral stone, copper zinc in the top, and activated carbon in the bottom. So this tank here takes out a lot of your uh, herbicides, chlorine, uh, heavy metals, um, bacteria, other things like that, right up to what a reverse osmosis system would. So it doesn't take everything out of the water, but it takes a, a good portion of all your contaminants, chlorine, heavy metals, all those contaminants. The final filter on the end is a 0.5 micron. So this will clean up any of the extra water coming out, uh, take out any of the sediment, anything that's left behind, and it's ready to drink. So now what we're going to do is replace the filters. The two filters every six months are the pre and post filters. The two tanks here last for about Anywhere between 300,000 gallons and 600. I think they have a 1 million now. There's a couple different options that you can purchase at the time when you get your system. But for now, every six months, we'll just repla replace the pre-filter and the post-filter. So what we're going to do is shut off the water and isolate the system at the bottom. So we can still have water running through the bypass loop in case the house needs it while I'm servicing. So we shut off the water valve here. We shut off the second valve here, and we open up the bypass loop here. So now we'll come down to the water tanks, and we'll screw these off. We have a catch pan under, a little bit of water comes out. So we'll, we'll take those off really quick, and we'll show you the next step. Stand by. Okay, so now we have the canisters off, the post filter and the pre-filter and we'll take these upstairs to the sink wash them out clean them up and go to the next step okay we have the canisters out it's time to wash them up as promised before you can see the old filters and the new filters you can see all the rust and sediment that's been captured even though we have city water the pipes are really old, we don't know what's flowing through them, and as you can see, there's a lot of rust and sediment, iron. Here's the new filter, here's the old filter, and with the post filter, the same thing, new and old. This is after about six months. We'll dump the filters out now, and as you can see, the water is a little bit dirty. And you might even see a little sediment. Down in the bottom. It's a little bit, not too bad this time. It varies just depending on conditions, but this is the reason for the filter here. So we'll wash these out and we'll go back downstairs and reinstall. Okay, now that we have the canisters all washed out and clean, we've put new filters in. The new pre-filter, just pop it down in. The new post-filter. And we'll line them back up, screw them back on into the canister at each point, And we'll be good to go. Do everything in reverse order from the disassembly. Okay, now that we have the canisters back on, we snug them up with a wrench, make sure they're good and tight. Remember to always lubricate your o-ring with a little bit of mineral oil on each one. Both are snugged up. 
And now we're ready to turn back on the water. So that's on. Turn on the other valve. Make sure to close the bypass loop. So now this is back closed again. Water's free flowing back through the system. And it's good to go again for another six months. Just if you're wondering, the pre filter is about $8 a piece, the post filters are about $30 a piece. And these are changed about twice a year. Uh, the center tanks, again, they last anywhere between 300 and 1 million, 300,000 and 1 million gallons. And those are replaced in roughly about a five to six year interval. Those do run about 800 for those tanks in the middle for the softener. Because they don't last forever. They clog up with the contaminants and all that. So that's the system in an overview. The Aquasana whole house water filtration system, pre-filter, salt-free water softener, water filter, and the 0.5 micron post filter. All right, guys, hope this helped out. I hope it kind of give you an overview of the whole system, how it works, and what it takes to maintain it. All right, this is Chris out here from My Old House Fix. See you guys.